Hey, what's going on, guys? It's TB and our frags. Okay, like, hey, Preston here, and I just want to make a video to let you guys know that Black Ops 2 right now is free to play for the weekend on PC. So, if you guys have like a you know a decent PC or you think your PC might be able to run Black Ops 2, uh, go to my link down below, and it, it's gonna give you a link to the Steam store because that's how you play Black Ops 2. You play it through program called Steam. And if you don't have a Steam account, it's free to make one. And you can play the game for free until like 1 p.m. on Sunday. And I think that's like American time. I'm not sure what time zone, so I'm assuming it's just like around the morning time and Sunday. So you can play Friday night, all day Saturday, and a little bit Sunday morning if you get up early. Um, of Black Ops 2. And this is awesome. Shut up, phone. My phone always like does this when I'm in the middle of recording a commentary. Um, and by the way, the background gameplay is a 29-0 with the random nuclear class set up uh, that I was gonna upload tomorrow this was supposed to be random nuclear class number 15 but I died one kill off the nuclear and then I get so mad I was oh man I'm so mad and uh, is what I have on the gun is it's three attachments and it's select fire so I had to use this as a burst fire assault rifle which is not that good it's really hard at close ranges so even though this might seem like an easy class it's really not trying to get 30 kills straight in a row without dying but that that's not the point of this commentary the point is we can always use more PC players, and I want to—I want you guys to know what it's like to play on PC. So, if you guys want to, go ahead and download it. Links down below in the description. All you do, if you don't have a Steam account, just register and make a new Steam account, and and then download the game for free. And well, you know, for free for the weekend, and then you have to pay for it if you want to, you know, buy it. But this is so cool because uh, they did this multiple times with like Modern Warfare 3 and stuff like that. And it's a great way for you guys to try the game out because a lot of people are like unsure if they want to play it on PC. They're like, do I want to spend, you know, another 40 bucks, uh, you know, on this game? You know, do I want to do that? And this is a great way for you guys to test it out because right now the PC community for Call of Duty, it's hurting, man. Like during the daytime, I think we have like 20 to 30,000 people playing. And then like at 6 p.m. and afterwards, it's only like 10,000. Like I've seen 7,000 people online. That's it. 7,000 people. So it's, it's you know, it's kind of ridiculous how little amount of people play on PC nowadays compared to how it was like back in Call of Duty 4. So this is a good way to give the PC Call of Duty community, uh, you know, a good boost. And I'm sure you guys are going to run into a lot of noobs because, you know, it's free to play weekend. So there's going to be a lot of noobs out there. And, you know, it's going to be good. So you guys aren't going to be running into like people that play on the PC all the time. Uh, you're also going to run into some noobs at the same time. So it's great. Um, so I highly recommend it. I want you guys to give it out a try. You know, give it a try. And if you guys are unsure if your PC can run it and stuff like that, the minimum system requirements uh, is what I believe is... I'm trying to think right now. I I'm, I'm not sure what the, uh, the processor is like a triple core uh, AMD or a dual core, you know, core 2 duo Intel processor. And then the minimum graphics card is an 8800 GT or a 3870 uh, Radeon graphics card. So if you guys know your system specs, you probably don't because, you know, most people don't know a whole lot about their PC and stuff like that. And it's no big deal. Um, that's, those are just like the minimum requirement specifications. And if you guys are interested in my controls for PC, I actually did a video, uh, you know, explaining all my controls and stuff like that. And I'll put it in the annotation above. Or you can just go to my channel and look up like, you know, what are my PC controls. And pretty much they're all default. So you don't have to worry about that too much. Um, and that's that's about all the tips I can give you guys. You know, if, if your game starts lagging, you can always check your frames per second. Um, Black Ops 2 has like a built-in program so you can check that. So if you if you think you're lagging or whatever and it's not, you know, ping related. And, you know, ping means your latency, like how bad you're lagging. If it's not, you know, if you're lagging because uh, your frames are dropping, not because you're bad internet or you're good internet or whatever, you can check it that way. I know I'm probably confusing the balls out of you guys. But anyways, I just wanted to make this video because... You know, the PC community is so precious to me because I've been playing on it forever. And don't get me wrong, you know, I don't, like, I don't, like, hate console players. Like, everybody thinks I hate consoles and I hate console players. Uh, that's not true. I just like the PC more. I just, it's where I belong, man. Everybody belongs in their own system and their own platform. And I just, I belong on the PC. And it's just a great way for you guys to test it out and whatnot and shenanigans. And I think it's, like, a 10 gigabyte game. So it's pretty big. So if you guys don't have, like, super internet... Then it might take like, you know, two or three hours to download. It only takes me like 30 minutes because I've got really good, a really fast internet. That's actually why I moved 
into the apartment that I live in right now so I can have this fast internet. Um, but yeah, so if you guys haven't yet, follow me on Twitter and Facebook. Links down below in the description as well to the link to, you know, play the game for free for the weekend. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks guys so very much for watching. And here's how I die one kill off the nuclear. I, I know, I'm bad. I'm sorry. Anyways guys, have a wonderful and safe day. Enjoy me rage quitting and uh, goodbye.